Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be my October project use it up update. So I do have quite a bit of progress on my products, but I have to say I don't have anything finished. I'm a little disappointed, but to be honest with you, most of the stuff that I put in last month in September was completely full and I typically don't use up a full product in one month. So I'm not surprised, but I do have a lot of great progress on my stuff. So yeah, let's go ahead and get into it. And just a reminder, this project is going until the end of November and I will start the winter project in December. So we do have another two months. So we have October and November to finish up these products. And I probably won't be adding in more things unless I finish off something coming up soon. So yeah, let's go ahead and get into the progress on my little sets that I made. So if you guys didn't watch the introduction, you can watch it up above. I'll link it. But I do have three different like scent sets going. The first one is pink velvet cherry. And then I also have almond blossom and I have a like apple cider donut kind of mixture combo scent family thing. So yeah, let's get into the progress on those three. Okay, so for my cherry velvet, pink cherry velvet, whatever I called it before, I have pink velvet cupcake in the body cream. I have the velvet sugar spray and sugar cherry crisp shower gel. So I got a ton of progress on my shower gels. I was like killing it this year, not this year, this month, um, because I was actually going on a ton of walks in the morning with Kai and like getting sweaty and having to go um, shower in the morning and shower at night after I did my workouts. So I got a lot of progress on this one and Sugar Cherry Crisp is Bright Cherry Delight, Crumbled Graham Cracker and Spun Vanilla Sugar. So here's my progress lines. I started all the way up here unused and then we're down to here. Definitely like past halfway, hoping this will be finished off for next month, which would be great because I do already have some that I need to put in that are leftover fall things that I could be using, but oh my gosh, I absolutely adore this scent. It is so, so yummy. I'm really sad that I probably won't be able to keep this until it like actually gets cold or we get our first cold snap because um, this one is so good in like 50 degree weather. Oh, it's delicious. So that's the first one. And then Velvet Sugar in the spray. I've been doing really good with my sprays lately. And here is my progress. So we started up here and now we're down to here. Now that might not seem like a lot, but for me, um, these more like floral ones takes a lot for me to use these up. So I'm making great progress and I will just continue this one. It is honestly a great scent. I definitely don't think it's like fall related at all, but I really enjoy it. And it's just like a nice like sweet berry scent. So I love it. It's great. So that's this one. And then the pink velvet cupcake body cream. I haven't been using as much because it's not cold here yet. And I really only use body creams when it's cold, but oh my gosh, this smells so good. <sighs> pink velvet cupcake is one of my favorites. The notes on this are sparkling red berries, whipped pink sugar and sugar praline. So it's just like a beautiful marshmallow berry scent. It's so yummy. So here's my progress. We were up here pretty much unused and then it got down to here. So I did definitely use like a quarter of it. So I'm not mad, but definitely need to focus on it more. Hopefully, hopefully it'll be colder this month and in November so I can use it more. But yeah, I will keep working on this one. Okay, now for my almond blossom set. So I do have it in the lotion, the shower gel, and the spray. So in the lotion, I made a little bit of progress here. You can tell from up here to down here, not quite halfway yet, but still pretty good progress. So I'm making my way down on the um, body lotion. And this one really doesn't have scent notes on it. It just says warm and cozy, sweet almond oil blended with vanilla orchid and cashmere musk. So it's just like an almond cashmere scent. I really love it. It's super nice and cozy. And then I have it in the shower gel, which I did get a lot of good progress on. So we were pretty much unused up here. I had just got this at Summer SAS. So up here and then down to right about exactly halfway. Such a great scent. I love this for using during morning showers because I feel like this sets the vibe for the day, makes me feel like I'm gonna be like productive and sophisticated. So yeah, just a gorgeous scent, really, really loving it. And then in the spray, I also got quite a bit of progress. So from here to here, as you can tell, it's been in a mini projects. I've had this since 2018, so it is four years old. I think this is my oldest spray besides like I have like a really old one from like 2014 or something. But yeah, 
gonna try and keep finishing this up hoping I can get it below this packaging line which would be what a little below halfway so that would be really nice if I could do that um, and just like keep working on this because I do adore this scent it is great year-round but I feel like it's really shining in the fall time where it's not quite cold but it's not quite hot it's really really nice my cider donut scent combo i have the lotion and cinnamon donut swirl and the shower gel and then i have the champagne apple and honey body cream in a mini i also have bonfire bash in the spray but i would not really consider this part of the collection i just leave this downstairs on my work from home desk and spray it throughout the day so let's go through progress on these so first we have champagne apple and honey in the mini body cream i did not use this a lot i have it on my bedside table to use as hand cream but we're going on two trips in October, we're going to ACL in Austin and we're going to Disneyland yay, in uh, like the 20th around that time. So I will definitely bring this with me and try to use it up. But here is my little bit of progress just using it as a hand lotion on my bedside table. So really enjoying it, though. I absolutely love this scent every year. It is amazing. And then I set these down so they kind of like got shooken up. But here is the uh, cinnamon donut swirl combo. The notes are sweet cinnamon, brown sugar, and fluffy dough. So I've been going ham on this lotion. I actually really have started to love this lotion. And when I first put it in my project, I didn't really like it. But wow, it is so yummy. I definitely get that like sweet brown sugar dough. It smells so good. So we started unused up here and now we're down to here. I have about a third left. I can definitely get through this in I think the next two weeks so I can focus on those other scents. But oh my gosh, it is so, so yummy. So making great progress on this one. And I'm also making great progress on the shower gel in it. So here that is, we're about halfway. So we started up here and now we're down here. And I'm really enjoying it in the shower. It's like a nice basic scent. It's really nothing special, but it's a nice like basic sweet sugary scent. And yeah, I'm just, I'm enjoying it. Just using it up. So yeah, that's that one. And then Bonfire Bash, the notes are vanilla bourbon, creamy sandalwood, and cashmere musk. I totally recommend this if you guys like a sweet gourmand, like just super plain and simple vanilla marshmallow scent. So, so good. So here is my progress on this one from here to here. So literally not a lot. I kind of forgot about this one until like last week. So I really have only been using it for a week um, during work, but I plan on continuing using it. And now I'm half, I'm past the halfway point. So I'm feeling really good about where I'm at, on my progress with Bonfire Bash, because this one is also kind of old. It's only from 2020, but still, yeah. I wanna just keep working on it and hopefully finish it up one day, maybe not this year, I don't know. Okay, and then I did have the Mini Midnight Amber Glow Mist in the project, and I just used it a tiny bit, like literally from here to here, so I don't have a lot of progress on it. I think I'm actually gonna pull this out of the collection but I do really enjoy this and I can see it being so yummy like right around like February, like January and February. It is like a nice cozy scent. It really just reminds me of vanilla mocha cream to be honest, but I don't have it in any other scent form, but I definitely plan on picking up more of this one either at the fall sale or SAS, but I don't think I'm gonna pick up any like right now. So that's Midnight Amber Glow. I'm just gonna take it out of the project because like I don't wanna force myself to use it. It's not really, I feel like it's not like right for the time that I'm in right now in the season. I feel like it's more for when it's like actually cold outside. So I'm gonna save this for later. And then I am traveling, like I said, so I'm gonna put in two minis and these are like actually my last two mini lotion and shower gel. So I have strawberry pound cake in the mini and I did use this a little bit cause I was getting nostalgic for strawberry pound cake. So we're about right here starting it off in the project. I can definitely finish this up on my next trip. And then a warm vanilla sugar in the lotion is also about halfway. And I'll just bring these two on my next trip and finish them off. I have no doubt that I'll finish these off. For perfume, I've been using Kayali Vanilla 28. I am obsessed with the scent. It is so yummy. It is like the perfect warm gourmand vanilla scent. It is so yummy. Um, I'm just obsessed. It is awesome. So I've gotten a little bit of progress on it. You can see it's like right here and it was completely full whenever I put, first put it in the project, but just using it up, you know, not crazy, but I think I'm going to ask for a full size of this for Christmas because it is 
amazing and I need it in a full size and I feel like I'm not using it as much because I don't want it to be gone. So yeah, totally enjoying this one. I'm gonna keep it in the project. And then I also have been using Replica Autumn Vibes. This is just like a little mini that I got from Sephora and I have just a little bit left. So probably like a couple more uses and I'll be done with this one as well. Okay, and the last two I have to update you on are my two hand creams that I have in the project right now. So I have the Aromatherapy Peppermint Essential Oil Body Lotion, but I'm using it as a hand cream. I think this pump is super um, useful and like very easy to use as a hand cream. So I leave this on my desk downstairs when I'm working and just use it up a little bit. So I've only used uh literally this much in the last month i also forgot about it um i was unemployed for a few weeks there so i was not using my home office so i just kind of forgot about this so uh, yeah gonna have to get back on the train to using this but we are down to here so i could definitely finish this off for the rest of the year if i focus so i'm gonna have to focus on this one and try and finish it up but yeah that is the peppermint essential oil and then another one that i've had on my table for work is white coconut caramel in the little hand lotion i've used a little bit of it um but not a ton so yeah not using a ton of it but this smells really great it smells just like caramely coconut really just like uh coconut cream pie is what it smells like to me but it still smells really great and i'm continuing to use it and i did have a champagne apple and honey hand lotion in this project but i for the life of me, I can't find it. So I think it's in one of my purses somewhere, but I can guarantee I probably have the same amount of use on it as this one because like I wasn't really using it a lot. So that is that one. Sorry, I don't have it to show you guys, but I will have it for the finale. Okay, I actually almost forgot about my two scrubs that I had in the project. So let me show you guys those. So I have Sweet Whiskey in the scrub. This is from last year and the notes are Golden Amber Vanilla Infused Liqueur and Sweet Red Berries. This is also out this year. They just brought it back, so. That's this one, it's a Celestial Scrub, I believe. Yeah, it's gorgeous. And I got a ton of use out of this one. So we started off up here and now we're down to here. Like, honestly, I'll be done with this in a few weeks. I'm so proud of myself. This is like so much fun to use. I'll have to get another Celestial Body Scrub because it leaves your skin with just like a little bit of shimmer on it. You can tell this has shimmer in it and it is like so moisturizing and it feels nice and like it feels luxurious using it in the shower. So totally recommend the Celestial Scrubs. They are so much fun. So this is, oh, and it's full of water, but this is like a really great everyday scrub because it's not harsh at all. It's just like a nice light exfoliation and a little bit of moisturizing. So totally recommend these scrubs and I'm going to repurchase some form, some, some scent of the same form. So yeah, loving it. And the last thing I have to update you guys on is the Tree Hut Pumpkin Spice Latte Scrub. This smells so good, but it is super, super coarse. So I can only use this like once a week. So I haven't made too much progress on it, but it was completely full whenever I showed you guys last time. So I did use it four or five times maybe, and that's the progress. So not too much progress, but oh my God, it smells so good. I'm obsessed with how this smells. It is amazing. So yeah, if you guys are still looking for some pumpkin scrubs, totally recommend this one. It is absolutely amazing and I will just continue to use it up. Hopefully I can get it to like about halfway before I have to pull it out of the project, but loving this one so much. Okay, so that is everything for my Project Use It Up October update. So I will see you guys in November to update you again on this stuff and hopefully I'll have finished some stuff by then because I feel like I'm getting pretty close on a few things. So that is everything for today's video. Let me know down below, what are you using up in the month of October? What are you going gravitating towards? Do you have like Halloween scents out? Do you have pumpkin scents out? Let me know down below, I'm really curious to hear. But yeah, that's everything for today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, like, comment, and subscribe down below. And I will see you all in my next video. Bye.